If you missed last week's episode, I bought a camper van. <laughs> I'm going to be traveling the country with my dog and my van, and I can't wait to bring y'all along. But first, I wanted to put my own touches on the van and make it a little bit more me. Got lots of packages. Okay, so I ordered some stuff on Amazon for the van, and I'm going to open it with y'all because I'm so excited. The first thing I got is this retractable leash for Nug. So basically what I'm going to do with this is I'm going to mount it onto the stairwell of the van and it's gonna be really great because as you can see it'll just mount and then oh. there's Nug. he's very excited that my dad's home but these two curtains they are light blue one is shorter for the back of the van and one is longer for the front don't know what this is oh a bunch of peonies i only wanted like one but you had to buy them in a bouquet of like 10 but i'm gonna put these in a vase and put them in my van <laughs> what's this Ah, it's my it's my cutlery. It's Christmas. I got gold cutlery because I am a gold gal and I want my cutlery to be nice and cool. <laughs> Dad's shaking his head. You know, I see you shaking your head over there, but roll your eyes. I am confident in no, my no, no, trip yet. <laughs> this is to prepare for the trip. I can't go without cutlery. <laughs> She's gotta eat. I've gotta eat somehow. Oh my gosh, this is very fancy. It came in a velvet pouch. <laughs> the velvet you need. The velvet I need. I literally have been going on a wild goose chase for velvet gold. <laughs> <laughs> Look how cute. Cool. This is an interesting Amazon box. It's really creepy looking because it's got like it's advertising football. Dots like everywhere. Well, it doesn't look like a football. It looks like a dragon. Ooh! My coloring organizer. Now, I'm excited about this because I feel like when you are in a van, you have to make the most of the space that you have. And so right now, there's a coloring organizer in there that's like, it takes up the entire drawer. And that just simply won't do because I want to put other things in that drawer too. So, this is a cutlery organizer, but it's really thin. Instead of it being super wide and taking up the entire drawer, I can put all my things. Knife, fork, spoon. I got some pots and pans. I got miniature ones. This is very small. We are on our way to pick up my van. They just called and said that it is ready. So I got a backup camera installed, a new radio that has Apple CarPlay, and some sensors so that if I'm backing up and I get too close to something, it tells me because I'm going from driving a very small car to a very big car, so I feel like that would be helpful. Okay, let me show you, moment of truth, the old radio. So that's what it looked like. This is the new one. Yeah, I like how that looks. It's like, I, I don't know if I showed you the before, but like before it was like a tiny, tiny little thing and that didn't have Apple CarPlay or anything. So this will be really nice for road trips and listening to music and stuff. So excited about that. All right, well, I've got the radio and everything set up. I think it's time to move my stuff in. Oy. I want to make sure that I am utilizing the space efficiently so that's perfect because now instead of taking up the entire drawer it's only taking up a little bit of it and I got this from the dollar store and honestly I could probably put my toiletries in here which will be awesome my little baby pots and pans so cute um, I verdict is still out on if they are too small but I have some rug um, like tape that I'm gonna put the rug down with then I need to figure out where these are gonna go. <laughs> he's got scared of the camera. Why? You know oh like? Oh my gosh, he is too. You know like? He's like hiding oh from you. <laughs> Nuggy, you have to be a YouTube dog. What's wrong with you? Nuggy, come look at it. Come sniff it. Nuggy, Nuggy. Come here. Come sniff it. Come sniff it. Good job. Oh my gosh, guys. He literally is so scared of the Yay, Thank you, Daddy. Thank you. 
this. Good job. Thanks, Padre. Save that. Okay, so don't throw that out. Okay. <laughs> so now Another we got a mounted rot layer. Were you so scared? Oh, he doesn't like it. All right, progress for tonight. Obviously, the curtains put those up. We just installed this for Nug. This is my rug. Let me move this. This is my rug that I got. So I think it'll look cute with everything. That's gonna be it for today, and I'll see y'all tomorrow when we continue. For a few hours trying to get a DIY project done and I figured it was probably easier just to bring the van here park it that way if I need any extra pieces it's easy to go to but I'll show you guys kind of what I'm trying to do so as you can see there's a lot of stuff in here um I stole my dad's toolbox for the day and this is a bunch of random stuff so I'm gonna those of you don't know, I love decorating things. I love DIYing things. I'm not great at it, but when I move into a space, I like to make it my own, and that is no different. When I bought this van, I knew that I was gonna do some renovations to it and make it a little bit more my speed. I have to figure out the measurements of everything, and I hope this goes smoothly. Might I also add that I'm glad I changed into shorts because it's literally, it said it was only like 75 degrees, but it feels like 100 outside, so. It's a little hot out here. Before I start anything, I'm going to have my lunch, which is a coffee cake thing. This fridge isn't even on, but I brought some liquid IV. This is lovely. I'm a novice at all this, so we're gonna see. Let's go to Home Depot. When I needed four of the 21 and a half. Well, does that mean I needed four of these? Yeah. Dang it. Well, I'm gonna have to go in and get some more wood, I guess. I only got enough to make to do one cabinet, not two. I was like, where did someone steal the wood? No, it was me. I just didn't get enough. I had to get some Panera. I was feeling famished. And I still need to go in. I don't even know how long I've been here, but I still need to go in and get the pieces of wood that I forgot to get. 
They had like no bagels, so I just had to get a plain one. <laughs> and my camera battery is dying. Okay, I'll see you soon. All right, I've made it home and I put everything back. So looking pretty good. Now the next steps, I'm gonna paint this first before I put on those wooden beads um, because I wanna be able to like really get like all the sides and stuff. And I feel like if the beads are on there, some of it will be unfinished. So don't want that. So let's get to painting. Chicken nuggets in here. Hi, puppy. Hi, puppy boy. I forgot something that I wanted to do. So I'm putting wood filler in these places. This is not done. I just started applying it with my finger because that's the only two that I got right now. Um, but I just want to make it look like seamless. And some of these were cut so they're not like exactly, like there's like a little bit of a space. So I'm going to fill all of these spaces uh, and let that dry and then I'll paint. Very professional. All right, it's a bit later. I just went and ate dinner and basically, um, this paint should be dry. <laughs> Emphasis on should. Whoa, I've been doing this DIY for so long. You like? I am a master at wood glue. Okay, I did it. Oh, oh my gosh, my back. Second or third day of these renovations. I went to church this morning, it was great, and it's now like literally 5.30 in the afternoon, so getting a later start on today's renovations. But as you can see, it all looks great so far. So I, like I said, I was gonna le like paint these white, but I actually like how they look natural, their natural color. I just need to install drawer pulls um, on those, I already did those, and then I need to paint all of these. Um, I don't know if you can tell, I painted that one already. You can kind of see a difference. So, right now, my job is painting. There we go. It's much more enjoyable when I get to sit and do this. Now it's time for the drawer pulls so luckily there's already the two holes that were in here from the previous holes but I just have to I already did it successfully off camera um, I don't know if you can see that I drilled a hole through here into here and the wood didn't split or anything so that's nice So we have a bit of a problem. Um, the screws that it came with are either too short or too big for this. And it hits this because, anyways, so I'm hoping, I just went in and grabbed some of these from my dad's tool shed, hoping that they work. Finally, after so many tries, I literally had to go get this whole big thing because it kept making too many trips inside. And I finally got it. Now I have to do the other one. Perfect! Yay! Finally! Hey, I forgot to do an outro for this video, but I wanted to say thank you for watching. And I know I didn't show like the complete finished product, but that's because I'm going to show it in the next video, which is going to be a van tour. So you'll just have to wait till next video. Hope you enjoyed coming along this little renovation journey with me. I'm super excited. I'm going to be going on my first trip this week. So 
follow along make sure you subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye everyone have a great day